our topic for today is inverse of a function. Given this function f of x equals x cubed plus 3x squared plus 3x minus 6, our goal is to find the f inverse of x. Now, you can pause this video if you want to give this problem a try. Now, suppose you pause this video. Now, let's see if you got the correct answer. All right. Now, first, of course, what is the graph of f of x equals x cubed plus 3x squared plus 3x minus 6? So, here's the graph using Desmos. And here's the graph of its inverse. Now, the goal in this question is to find out this function that represents the inverse of this f of x. So, definitely, we have an inverse. The goal is to find the equation of that inverse. Now, to begin with, what is the steps in finding the inverse of a function? So, to find the inverse of a function, we follow these four steps. Change the function notation f of x to y. Change all x to y's and y's to x. Third is solve for y. And the fourth one is replace y with f inverse of x. The first step is very easy because we need to replace this f of x with y. Sure. The second step is also easy because we need to change this y to x and this x to y like this. This y to x and this x becomes y. Now the hard part is the third step, which is we need to isolate the variable y. So we need to solve for the value of y in terms of x. Now the question is how we do that. Here's the first thing. First, let's add 6 on both sides. Alright, so x is in the left-hand side and y is on the right-hand side. Next, y cubed plus 3y squared plus 3y. This is familiar. So to get the value of y, Let's add 1 on both sides. And 6 plus 1 is 7. Now, why we add 1 on both sides? Because, recall, if we expand n plus 1 cubed, we have n cubed plus 3n squared plus 3n plus 1. This is similar to y cubed plus 3y squared plus 3y plus 1. If we replace this n with y, this y cubed plus 3y squared plus 3y plus 1 is just y plus 1 raised to the power of 3. Now we can now isolate the variable y. So let's cube on both sides. And the right hand side is just y plus 1. Now to isolate y or to solve for y, let's subtract 1 on both sides. Therefore, y equals cube root of x plus 7 minus 1. This is the third step. And the fourth step is replace this y with f inverse of x like this. And this is our answer to this question. Now let's check if this is absolutely correct. Now let's reveal this function, this blue function, and we have here negative 1 plus cube root of x plus 7 or simply we can interchange this cube root of x plus 7 minus 1 this is the same thing as negative 1 plus cube root of x plus 7 therefore our answer to this question what is the inverse of f of x equals x cubed plus 3x squared plus 3x minus 6 and our answer is cube root of x plus 7 minus 1 and as always we are Done.